Jennifer here with Buddy Dog Shop, and joining me today is Buddha Belly. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. This is Root and Tootin', and Root and Tootin' is taking a little nap right now, um, so I will wake him up in just a minute when I do a demonstration. Uh, today, I would like to go over Buddy Dog Shop's Flea and Tick products. Um, it is the season for Flea and Ticks, so I thought it would be a good time to share um, application and what's in it, things like that, show you how to use it. Before I get into that, I really wanted to clarify a misconception people have towards essential oils um, and pets. Now, there are different grades of essential oils, and each company markets them differently, depending how they how they want to sell it. Um, and it's all about money to them. Whereas, for me, it's about effectiveness. It's about working and keeping animals safe. It's the reason I started doing this. Um, a long time ago, my holistic vet recommended that I become a distributor of Young Living products. Not necessarily to sell the products to other people, um, but to use them um, for my own purposes, for my own pets, uh, for their special needs. And out of that bloomed these products for flea and tick, um, skin soothing, and all sorts of different things. And that's where, um, you know, after all this time, I knew how effective it was, how they worked, and I wanted to share it. So here I am today sharing it with Buddy Dog Shop. Um, I've done my homework with these oils, and, you know, you can, you can go online and think you know what you're talking about and purchase some oils that are, you know, high quality, whatnot, and you can put them on your animals and there could be problems. You really have to know um, the best of the best in order to um, to really be successful in using oils. You know, if you pick up a therapy or a uh, aromatherapy grade and you put it on your pet, you're going to have problems. Um, you know, whether it's a rash and it's minor or it's a, a seizure, you know, this happens. So please be very careful when using essential oils. Do your homework. Do your research. Or, um, you know, if you don't want to make it on your own, come see me, come check out my website, learn a little bit. Um, that's what I'm here for. This is what I want to do. Um, I want to provide um, a safer alternative for your pets. Um, you know, because I trust Young Living's products, um, I feel confident in the effectiveness um, and being able to sell it to the public. Um, I know it works and I would be a horrible business person if I put a product out there that was harmful to your animals. Um, that's why I have consulted with my holistic vet. That's why I have made sure all of my ingredients are top of the line. That's why I have double checked that each ingredient is not harmful to your pets. And that's why I specify that when you try my products, you do a test. You test the belly. Um, you put a spot on where you can see the, the skin, put a drop and see if there's a reaction before you actually use the full recommended dose. Um, that's really important to start because you need to know, you know, each animal is different. Um, they're not all the same. Size, um, problems, whatever it is, you just want to always do a test. So that's what I recommend. Anyway, um, would you like to see how uh, we apply this stuff? Let's see if we can wake up Tootin. Come here, Tootin. Hey, Tootin, come here. You're going to be my little demonstration boy, okay? Okay, so this is Root and Tootin, and he is epileptic. Um, he is part pit bull, part vishla. Um, pit bull's not really the proper term because there's no such thing, but we're going to just use that term because everyone's familiar with a pit bull. Anyway, um, because he's epileptic, he's on a lot of different medications. Um, it's not something I can control through holistic remedies, so we have him on, um, you know, quite a different mix of, uh, of meds, but with my treatment, because he's on so many different meds, I still have that confidence that giving him this treatment, he's going to be okay. Um, I've been doing it for a long time, so that's where I am. Um, so I'm going to start off with Buddy Dog Shop's um, Flea and Tick Remedy. This is the Deep Woods formula, and if he's not going to lean out of here, we'll just put a couple drops. Now he's about 50 pounds. Do a couple drops here, a couple drops on his back side, and I'm just going to rub it in a little bit. It smells really good, and if he decides he's going to roll around on the furniture later, I'm okay with that because <laughs> spreading this stuff out is actually more beneficial than uh, you'd like to believe. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the Buddy, uh, Buddy Slim Tick Bug Spray. Now, with the bug spray, um, it's basically the same um, blend as the drops. 
but you get more coverage and I believe the two of them together really are more effective. You can spray the legs, um, the belly, you want to kind of keep it away from the eyes, you want to keep it away from the genitals, um, it's not going to hurt but you know, it's better to be safe than sorry. So he's got full coverage now and I'm just going to do a little rubbing in the legs and the neck because that's where most of the flea and ticks like to uh, begin their journey on this. And Tootin's actually been flea and tick um, free for, I can't even tell you how many years, I really don't know. Um, we haven't had a flea problem, and I believe that it is due to these products. Um, so that is it for today. Um, I'm going to go let Tootin uh, go roll around on some piece of furniture for a while. And um, I hope that uh, everything that I have here is informative for you. Um, as I mentioned, all of my products are therapeutic grade, Young Living Essential Oils. Um, actually, the flea and tick um, spray and the drops um, have some great quality essential oils and really, really make a difference. Um, and I hope that you find, uh, you know, softer skin, um, less flakes. They smell great, um, and it really repels against not just the flea and ticks, but mosquitoes, gnats, even ants. Um, I had Buddy laying outside um, on the patio, and some and he was laying near some ants, and they wouldn't go near him. It's like he was in this bubble of natural essential oils that kept everything away. So it was pretty amazing, and I hope that uh, you check it out. Check out the website um, or our Facebook page, um, BuddyDogShop1.com or Buddy Dog Shop on Facebook. And on the website, you can actually uh, go to the section on Q&A, and if you have any questions, please feel free. Just ask, um, and I'm happy to answer them at any time, okay? So, take care. See you all soon.